what's going on everybody welcome to rng crypto it's your boy here with you for another video guys and in this video i'm going to follow up my previous video about connect united i wanted to make sure that i answer a few questions that i've already seen in the telegram but more importantly i want to give you guys a step-by-step -step guide of what exactly you need to do to establish your account using my referral link to buy a node and then to install that node on a virtual private server or on your computer so we're going to be walking through all of that step by step but at the very beginning for those of you who have no idea what i'm talking about i'm going to give you a quick overview of connect united the ecosystem of projects that they're building that have been literally in the works for years and are coming out here in the next couple of months and the huge huge opportunity that lies ahead of us in getting involved early guys so if you are interested in this content guys stick around smash the like let's dive right into it Before we dive into it though, I have to let you guys know guys, I am not a financial advisor guys. Anything I say do should not be taken as such. Please make sure you're always doing your own due diligence and research before investing any money. In fact, in this case, we are not investing. We are supporting an ecosystem of blockchains that are going to change the world. Guys, don't look at this as an investment. You are simply purchasing a piece of software that's going to help run these decentralized ecosystems and in turn of running and performing uh, tasks or computing tasks for that ecosystem, you are going to be rewarded in their tokens and those tokens may or may not have any value guys we don't know that however think gala games guys think gala games see what happened there with that said let's jump into it so i want to make sure that we have an understanding of the ecosystem and how connect is involved and what role connect plays in in the middle of all of this right you can see connect right here in the middle of all of these projects so these are some of the projects green is the only one that's out now these other projects are going to be released uh in the next two to six to eight months uh blue is set to be released within one to two months uh and i'm not sure the timelines for these other projects so the only one that's live right now is green uh so that's really really uh, exciting because that means we are early and you can see here gala games again this is the birthplace of gala they split off and that's sort of the goal for all of these projects to eventually uh, get to a size uh, where they have enough node operators where they can sort of branch off and do their own thing that's the whole goal uh, but in the beginning they're all going to need help right without a community doesn't matter how good your use case is how good or strong the blockchain is and, and how it applies in the world if you don't have people backing it, it's very hard to get traction. It takes a long time. So that's sort of uh, the role that Connect plays here. And Connect is backed or powered by the wind chain. So this is sort of the social aspect of all of these uh, projects. So there are two ways of getting a project, two ways. One, you could go directly to Blue or Green or Element, whichever project, and purchase your note there. Create an account and purchase your note. And you would, for running that note, receive rewards in that token right so if i went to green website created an account there bought a green node run that green node i'm getting green rewards that's one way however if i go to connect and i purchase my green node on connect As i'm now getting three rewards capture, one i'm getting registered. the same the exact same rewards for running my green node right just same I, I would as if i went there directly two i'm going to be getting win rewards on top of that because i created or bought my node through connect and then three you are getting commissions paid for anyone that buys a note that you refer, right? And this is what Connect is doing to incentivize us people, the world, to spread the word, get as many users onto this community, into this community to run nodes because that is what we need. These projects need uh, nodes to be operated by people all across the world. They need uh, the awareness to be spread, right? And that is exactly what Connect is doing and how they are rewarding their users for doing that. So I think is a very creative way, uh, sort of an outside of the box thinking approach for people to spread the word and for this ecosystem to grow quickly guys so that is sort of my uh, two cents on that i wanted to make sure guys that you know that when you are creating your node or buying your node through connect you are getting three forms of rewards the initial node that you're going to be operating that's going to be paid out those rewards the immediate uh, additional rewards of win mm -hmm. and then on top of that any commission for referring so guys i urge you guys once you've signed up using my referral code of course 
also spread the words to your family tell your mom tell your dad tell your brother tell your sister tell your uncle tell aunt sandy i don't care tell someone guys get them on board this is exciting we are early it's going to be huge in the future and we are here at the very very start guys so let's move on let's actually talk about how you're going to create an account how you're going to buy it and how you're going to set it up guys all right so this is it this is how to go about getting everything set up so number one you need to create yourself an account so use my referral link down in the description below click on it guys i'm going to click on my referral link from my first video here once i click on it it's going to take me to the sign up page here very self-explanatory obviously just first last name email address password as well as this terms of service and the privacy policy if you want to check that out to know exactly what you're getting yourself into guys so i'm not going to go through this because it's self-explanatory i'll see you guys on the other side go ahead and pause the video get your account created and we'll walk through it step by step all right guys so after you've created your account this is the place that you're going to end up at this is your landing page this is basically your profile page uh, think of it as like a facebook page but it's not Facebook, it's obviously connect. Uh, so here you can follow people, you can share their posts, you can post your own stuff, uh, pretty cool stuff, but that's not what we're focusing on. What we're focusing on is how to get these nodes bought and how to actually then install them. So to get there, you need to get to your dashboard. And the first thing that we want to do to get to your dashboard, you need to click on your name here at the top right. That took me to this page. The first thing you want to do is link the accounts or link your connect account to your specific project account. And you can do that simply from the landing page. I know this one says here, you know, click here to link your green account, but this is for all the accounts. So this is the quickest way, in my opinion, to get there. So just scroll down a tad, click here to link account, click on this button. And then when you get there, you'll see that you'll have a whole bunch of unlinked accounts here on the left. Right. Again, this is my demonstration uh, profile just to show you guys my new profile registered. or the profile I actually use has everything already connected. Uh, so if you're not signed up for any of these, you need to do that first. Right. So if you know you want to run a green node, you'll need to sign up for green first. It's going to take you to that website where you get to sign up for green. Right. You can see here. Uh, you can sign up for green the same way that you would have done for connect. But again, you need to do this through connect. Uh, so once you've signed up for green, then you can come back here to this link page and you can actually link your green account. It's going to ask you to log in. And then after you've linked it, it's going to come up on the right side and you can go down the line for all of these. Yeah, it's a little bit of work at first, but it's not too bad, uh, guys. So if you know that you want to have a green switch and a blue node, go ahead and sign up for those three, link them. And then once they're all linked, then we are ready to purchase. And to do that, you'll need to go back to your summary. So from here, you'll click on dashboard. It's going to take you back to this page. And now we can click on buy droid blockbot. All right. So that will be the next part of this, guys. So I'll click on this. Okay, guys. So this is the next screen. And if you want to go ahead and download, you can. It gives you an option to download now. Uh, since I'm going to do this on a VPS, I'm not going to download my software yet. Uh, Okay, so I've clicked on I'll do it later and I've gone back to my dashboard again. You can get there by clicking on your name in the top right. And guys, you can go to download Droid or Blockbot if you're going to download this on your machine. Uh, and once you click on it, it's going to take you down here and you have the option if you've got a Mac OS or a Windows machine. These are the only two options. Linux is coming, but it's not yet available. Uh, so then you click on that and you literally just download the software, open it, log in and you're ready to go. Okay, and I'm going to show you that, but in the VPS environment. So the next step now is getting your VPS SW built. VPS so audio go to vulture.com. That's what I use. You can use whatever VPS service you like, uh, but Vulture is what I use. Uh, once you log in there, you'll see, um, you know, under products, you'll see what you already have. If you've got stuff, you can see I've got a VPS running for one of my galas, and I've got my green node here. Uh, for this example, even though I just purchased green licenses, it's really just adding them to my existing node. I'm actually going to stand up a switch node which I haven't downloaded or set up yet. Uh, so what I'll do, need to do is number one is add a node or add a service or server, right? So you click, you go, if you hover above this uh, plus sign, click on deploy new server. Okay, what we need to do is cloud compute. That's the option that we want to use. So the type of server will be a cloud compute, all right? I'm going to use Atlanta as my uh, destination. I like to use Frankfurt as well. Uh, aber ich bin gerade nicht in Deutschland, also uh, we're going to use Atlanta. Yeah, for those of you Germans, you caught that. Uh, so once you select Atlanta or whatever city you'd like, uh, you want to make sure that you're going to use a server type. And for this, we're going to use Windows. Don't worry about Windows Core, use Windows. Okay, select Windows. And here you can see the version of Windows. Uh, they're all the same price. Okay, I'm going to go with the 2022 um, 64x. 
okay which is basically what i like to use uh, and and th there's no issues with running this license or this software on that okay same price it's ten dollars a month all right we're going to be using the lowest that we need here for the server size uh, sim simply because uh, there's actually not a huge need of computing power yet for these um, so use the smallest server size that you can uh, for whatever vps that you use okay and then after that i'm not going to be worried about any ipv6 or any ddos protection or anything like that uh, we're not worried about any of that uh, i'm going to go ahead and give it a name so for this this is going to be my switch server uh, it will be SWG switch audio one. capture okay not registered actually let me preface that with uc space switch one all right so this will be my first of many switch nodes to come um, deploy now so it's 20 bucks a month all right and you can see now it's installing i may or may not pause the video we'll see how quickly this goes all right and the virtual server just completed okay and you can see that it's already running you can see uc switch one running all right and i actually uh, misnamed this so what you want to do next is click on this it's going to take you into your screen here and what you'll need to know is this password here i'm obviously not going to show it here because then you guys could potentially log into my server uh, but this is what you'll need eventually to log in uh, but before that i want to change my name so if you're curious how to do that you just hover over the name here at the top it's not uc it's cu right connect united okay cu1 all right so this is my switch one uh, i'm going to now view the console this is going to open up a new tab in your browser actually logging into the server okay and this one may take a little bit because it's the first time i'm opening the server all right um it's actually kind of quick here so here you cannot press Control alt delete press on your keyboard w initially okay to do this you actually registered. need to do it using the prompt here you hit this little uh, extender right there it's going to open up a window click on the a icon all right and then down here this is the command for Control alt delete which is what we need to actually start logging in so once i click that now i can start logging in as the administrator and i'm going to pause the video here while i type in the password right but the password again is by going back into your dashboard here you see all your information your ip address you are the administrator and this is your password and when you click on this it's going to show you the password so i'm going to do that now log in and then continue the video from there so once you've logged in and everything's loaded which takes a few minutes uh, the server manager will have popped up for you uh, you don't need to worry about anything here you can just close it out guys uh, and then the next step would be and by the way everything's going to lag in here right even the mouse as you kind of go across your screen so just be aware of that uh, but you'll want to open up the uh, explorer and visit the connect united website and then from there we'll want to log in um, so i'm not going to worry about syncing anything um, all right so again this is all the first time everything's happening so it's asking some just random stuff uh, so we're not going to worry about any of the other tabs and I'm going to go to connectunited.com. Okay. And I'm going to log in. All right. So I'm not going to show you guys myself logging in, but uh, you'll see me in my main screen once I've logged in. Okay. So I am at the main screen now. And what you want to do is click these three lines here at the top right and go to your dashboard. All right. SW and the next step would be then to go ahead and registered. download the block bot for in my case switch so i'm gonna this is a windows server what i'll need to do is input my email address and then sign a bunch of legal language and sign off before i can actually download this so i'm going to do that now here you can see uh sort of the legal statements that you have to agree to uh, and you just need to check the box and initial all of these so i'm going to go through these now so once you've done that it's going to take you to this next screen where you can actually pick the node that you want to download all right so again uh even though i purchased green uh, droid licenses for this example video i'm actually going to be downloading a switch node because i don't have one running yet uh, so that's what i'm going to be doing obviously whenever you purchase a certain project uh, license you want to download the corresponding node for that uh, so you'll click on this and it's going to start the download for you okay and depending on your server it may or may not take uh, several minutes but uh, mine's finally completed here uh, so once the download is done, go ahead and open the executable file. It's going to install, right? And once it's installed, it pretty much will launch itself. And that is all, guys. So this is the way to get your note up and running on a Microsoft or Windows server. 
but I do need to let you guys know that if you're planning on running several nodes, right, more than one or two, uh, the more cost effective way of doing this would be to install it using an Ubuntu server. Uh, which is only about five dollars a month uh, for vulture and i'm gonna be going through that as well once i get my bundle once i get the actual uh five different nodes or smart nodes that i'm going to be purchasing as part of the blockbot bundle and then I'll, it's a little bit more complicated it definitely requires uh there's a guide as well and i'll be linking that in that video but uh, it's more cost effective so if you're going to run more than one or two Definitely go with the Ubuntu version of these servers and, and go through that. And I'll be making a video on that exactly showing you how to go about doing that. Uh, but yeah, so this is going to load. I'm going to log in and you'll see what the node software is actually going to look like uh, once we're all logged in. So let me log in right now. So I've just logged in to the software and you can see I've got my node up and running. Uh, again, this is the very first time that I'm running the switch node, so the switch rewards aren't there yet. In fact, uh, this is a test net for switch currently. You can already start earning rewards for switch. However, you will not be getting any rewards paid out to you until this has been running for about 30 days. That's what they've announced. So this is going to run for 30 days just to make sure there aren't any glitches, any any bugs that they need to fix uh, so they can locate those. Uh, and then anyone that's been running the nodes uh, for those 30 days will be paid retroactively when they actually do go live so i recommend if you've got a switch node already go ahead and start running those and you can see here i have nine regular node licenses again these are the fractionalized licenses and a smart node would be the full potential of full earnings which i will have once i get my bundle going uh, but for now i'll have nine nodes running and uh, yep that is all guys i hope that this was helpful guys if you have any further questions visit us in the telegram there are lots of people that are getting on board that are also uh, in part more educated on this than i am already so there's definitely lots of help there so jump in there if you have questions if you like this content like the video smash the subscribe button and i'll see you in the next video take it easy peace